That's a heck of a set, tight. Everything can be done out of system. Bozio behind again. D ball. That's a big block from Mazzaro. Tracking that D ball all the way back. Thailand hadn't set that ball in a while, but that was a great track by the middle, getting all the way out, getting those hands right next to her outside, sealing it up. Yeah, Mazzaro and Omarui. No touch. Coach Deny. Challenging. We'll see whether there was block touch. It looks like, yeah. Oh, yeah, the right hand. Mazzaro. Mazzaro. That inside hand, definitely a finger bent backwards. It's a great call. Good challenge by Thailand. Thailand looking to go up 2-1 in the match. Powerful, yet again, Omarui. It's a big swing from Omarui, and typically when Italy gets those good passes, they're gonna go right to their middle, so it was a great decision by Bozio getting that outside ball, and Omarui, a lot of court to hit cross court. Squarcini back to serve. serve from Federica Squarcini. Exactly what you want from someone in that's coming just to serve the ball. This is the serve that is so difficult. It's a hybrid serve. It's not quite a top spin, not quite a float serve. And the way that it's coming straight down is so difficult if you're in service receive. Outside, yet again, no touch. And Thailand has to be happy about that break because Squarcini on the end line, I mean, those were bullets coming in from serve. So that was big for Thailand to get out of that one, get the ball back and try to reset. Yeah, we're seeing a lot of young talent. Pivotal point. And just like that, Italy within one late. Emily, we saw the mirror reverse of this in the first set where Italy was up to Thailand, answered back and ended up winning the first set. We'll see. And, and Italy has to do a great job, again, of really distributing that offense, how they have been getting that middle involved, and then just staying clean. Keep the ball in play, whether it's from the end line or whether you're hitting, you have to keep that ball inside the court. Pass is on the money, options available. It shows you what a great pass does, right? Freezes the middle blocker for a moment just to see if they're gonna run the middle. Yeah, and a great ball, Pimpi Chaya from the back row. Those Italian blockers just laid to it, so she has full reins to take a big swing on that. Another one behind, Marui. Is 20 years old, part of that youth movement. And it's been exciting to see her really come in and step up right away for this Italian squad that is going to have to look to some of those younger players, especially this week during VNLs. Now yeah, we've seen that a lot uh, along a lot of the rosters for the 14 person roster for this week. Trying out some younger players with a combination of vets. You know, the Poland did that, the United States did that, Italy clearly has done that. Ball still in play. Free ball to Thailand. What an up, Parochiale. Parochiale worth celebrating. That'll get Italian fans pumped up. Parochiale making incredible saves, incredible digs to keep that ball up on their side, which Woo! leads to transition offense. There are not a lot of libero's that are going to be able to make that dig, especially one-handed to the left. So difficult resulting in the Italian point. 
Locked up, 23 apiece. Italy right where they want to be. Transition play. That ball moving so much. I mean, no spin on it. It just dropped right in front of her. The youngster, just 20 years old, serving for the third set. Pass is on the money. Another crazy dig by Parochiale. That one, I mean, coming in with so much momentum. Just a bit off on that swing. Really side swiping it. Even again in the third set. Matches even at one set apiece. Third set even at 24 apiece. Barakiale, trouble pass. Tamari in play. Wow! Threading the needle in the middle. Tata. Hotdow adjusting so well to that set. It wasn't exactly the set that she wanted, but she was able to make something out of nothing. See that ball coming a bit quicker than she would have wanted, but snapping that wrist down as fast as she can. First set point, Thailand. Going to the middle. Danese almost smiles. And so good in front of the setter, really just making her space well. Getting all the way back and now sending her to the service line. Now at the middle back row, they have to be careful of the middle of the court where Thailand can get pretty shoddy. Beautiful set. Absolutely ideal. all smiles as they're spreading out their offense well and an incredible save. Typically with those one hand saves, you don't see them going backwards. Usually they're going straight up to a middle. That is an impressive set in Born Fun. There's no question that ball was going outside, still able to get it through. Huge block by Italy, and we're tied again at 26 apiece. Malwal has really stepped up during this set as they put her in this match, lining up that block so well, allowing her middle to become involved, now sending Malwal back to the service line. Heavy roof, an extended awning by Italy leads to this match. <laughs> service error, and it's set point again, Thailand. Better wins on the joust. And a miscommunication from Thailand almost cost him. <laughs> Italy she hit that like the top knuckle of her middle finger, but it fell. Yeah, it seems like the timing has been a little bit off for Italy, but those yep. middles are still able to make something out of nothing, still trying to you know, just get the ball over the, court, over the net and try to live and see another day, another point. Tachuan has been fantastic. One of the veterans for, or not one of the veterans, excuse me, a 23-year-old for this Thailand team. And she's just been relentless on the outside. And they keep going back to her. I mean, she has that quick arm swing. She's able to really barrel it through a lot of blocks with the speed that she hits it. strong in the third set. And Thailand did a great job switching up their offense. Thanks for watching. Leave a like and make sure to subscribe to Power Volleyball for more volleyball videos.